So, Sir Lancelot has not yet returned. Let us hope he is all right. <coughs> you should get some rest. Your wounds have yet to fully mend. I'm fine. I think I've staved off death another day. So, Warren, there was something I wanted to ask you. Hmm, this has the sound of something serious. Why did you come to our isles? The real reason. Why do you want to know? If your ends are the same as Lotus, I would ask you to return to Zenobia. Oh. I have no wish to fight you. If you've another purpose here, perhaps I can help. I already told you, we were banished. The truth, Warren. Ah, very well. The truth, then. We are here on an errand for our king. But I assure you, we have no designs on Valeria. Our true purpose is quite different. We will return as swift as possible, Majesty. This banishment was a necessary evil. Fool a friend to fool a foe, or so they say. We deserve no less. The safekeeping of the blade was our sworn duty. On the honor of the Holy Knights, we will return Brynhilde to its rightful place. Whatever Lotus's reason for taking the blade, it belongs here. See it done. Lancelot. Your Majesty. Brynhilde? All this intrigue over a sword? No ordinary sword. It is said that he who wields Brynhilde wields a conduit to the wisdom of the gods and to their wrath. I cannot vouch for the legend, but regardless, the sword is an ancient Zenobian heirloom. We must retrieve it at any cost. And it was the Dark Knights who stole it. Quite right. We were convinced they had taken the sword to Lotus, yet all the while it was in Valeria. Did they bring it here as mere subterfuge, or for some deeper purpose? We must... <laughs> must find out. <coughs> Mislike the sound of that cough. You had better rest now. Think no more on the sword. We will find it, and when we do, it will be safe. I've no doubt of that, Denim. Thank you. <laughs>